my editor showed me of this guy's scripting as Zareth, which is actually kind of interesting. This guy was just streaming his scripts. No idea why, he probably just wanted attention, but it's fucking crazy the way his game looks. It's like super, super zoomed out, which is, and like, it gives him all info, like every CD, flash, summoners, CDs, what they leveled up first, just so much info. Honestly, it's like info overload. If I, if I played like this immediately, I would actually probably initially play a little worse. Just because it's info overload. Like, it's, it's crazy the way his game looks. Evade on, EQ exploit on, E dive on, mode none. What the fuck is this? All right, let me see his team fighting. His game looks so strange. I, what I don't understand is like, how is it even within the game at all to play, like to have your cameras zoomed out this much? Like, how is it even possible to have your camera this way ever in League? You know, is that like a client side option from spec mode? What? But he's in the game. Wow, he's dog shit. <laughs> what the fuck? Wow, you can even change your skin with this. What the fuck? Somebody put so much effort into developing these cheats. Wow, he can change his fucking skin mid-game? He can change the skins for all everyone in the game. Wards, minion skins, visuals, target selector, Aurora Orb, I have no idea what that is. Evade, Lords, Pred, Utility, Zedith, AIO. What is this, man? There is no video. Uh, my my editor Sammy actually downloaded this from the scripter's Twitch VOD, which is now off. So you can blacklist certain players. Here's actually one thing that Riot should get a lot of credit for. There is basically no cheating in League. Like obviously you're watching a video of it, but there is so rarely actually cheaters in League compared to other games. I think Riot does a really good job. I don't know how the fuck they do it. All you need to do is play PUBG, Call of Duty, fucking, you know, Warzone, Apex, CSGO. Like, you will understand how awful it is to play competitive games against cheaters. Like, every competitive game struggles with it except for a few. So he's hitting, like, every fucking skill shot, right? I played against a scripting Xerath and actually shot on him. Okay. Here's the problem with people, especially in League scripting mechanically, is like... You can't script game sense. Like, this guy's mechanics are better than Faker's with, with Zareth, but his actual, like, game sense, his his positioning, is the script can't make him play the game better that way. Like, it's just, it's always going to be shit. So you actually can win against somebody who's, like, doing the equivalent of a spin bot in CSGO, right? Like, in CSGO, somebody's spin botting, and he runs down mid on Dust 2, you are insta headshot the second you peek him. In in league, like you actually do have a decent chance of beating someone who's cheating their ass off. Like look at this. What? What? <laughs> wow. The script can immediately track LeBlanc W. Look at that. Amazing. That is fucking amazing. And 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 I'm gonna fast forward now because I accidentally like peaked the later part of the game and he's two and three so he goes he has this advantage and ends up like what is happening he's like chasing into the enemy jungle he dies because like i said like he has no game sense he auto attacks dragon there like jesus christ man like league is just too hard tracking everybody this is pretty interesting, though. I don't think I've ever seen um, scripts this advanced. I've definitely seen first-person perspective of stuff, but, like, this is crazy. It tells you where everyone was last seen. Um, it's telling you where they're right-clicking, like, where they're moving, which, to be honest, like, what what is even the point of this? Like, when you see this, right, when you see LeBlanc, like, going this, what is the point of this line even showing up? Like, is it not obvious to you that they clicked up because their character is moving up? You know, like, I, don't, I feel like this script is actually kind of, like, it's, like, not that useful in that way. Like, why does it matter where he's clicking? You can see where his champion is moving. Is, is that just a script kind of, like, interpreting in, like, real time calculating where he's going to be?
Everyone's ult is almost ready. Wow, look at these. Look at these fucking... Holy shit. Did he win this game? Wow, he won this game. Okay, what about the next game? So next game he's playing Draven. And it's a it's an easy win. Kind of want to see Draven. I want I kind of want to see what a scripting Draven looks like. Let's see if let's see if I'd be able to spot it in a in a game myself. I bet like a Riot developer would have so much fun watching this and like talking about this. I I need to go get one actually. I need to get a developer to talk me through these scripts and tell me like how is this even possible? All this information is just available to the user. Like, in-game, it's available, and so obviously the script can scrape that fucking info and, like, turn it into a UI. Because obviously, like, it's getting info that is unavailable to you normally. Like, his screen is not panned mid, but he can pan his screen mid right now and see how much XP his mid pike has. Isn't that crazy? It's info that is normally completely unavailable to you as a fucking... You know, you're, you can't have your screen five places at once. Captain Jack Lance. Oh, what? Why did it pick that creep? That was weird. It shouldn't have picked that creep. Bad script. Bot lane. And he walked into turret. His script fucking totally... Wow. <laughs> what the fuck is this? Tris jumps on him. He cancels it with E, which is very nice. And then his his script just like totally shits itself. Like his script just thinks he's blue side or something. He's walking under his own he's walking under the enemy turret. We need to we need to revisit the developers here. He knows where the when the jungle creeps died. Is that a real fucking thing? Like map hack actually like that? Orb walker. Extra wind up time. So he's like he's like making it have extra time between his like automatic orb walking. I mean obviously this guy was banned. It would be completely ridiculous if he wasn't banned. Uh flash? Oh my god. What is wrong with his script? His script sucks. His script is terrible. What the fuck is that? And his build is horrible too. I, the, the script is insane. I would uh I would you know, if I could do it, I would like love to fuck around with that on stream. I would not obviously go into a ranked game. I would not even, I would probably not go into anything but a custom game with, with friends and like fuck around with it. But it, it's like, it's like interesting to me.